What makes plant-based food so awesome? Is it the glucose that is the source of energy for our bodies, or is it the fiber content that helps to keep things flowing for us in our GI tract, or maybe it is the low-calorie content that makes them ideal for weight loss? There's no doubt that these are all some of the aspects that make plant-based foods so great, but perhaps we're forgetting something important, polyphenols. So what are these polyphenols, and what's so special about them? Stay tuned as we look at the top 7 health benefits of polyphenols, which makes them so incredibly important. What are polyphenols? Polyphenols are miraculous plant compounds that have amazing health benefits for us. These compounds are potent antioxidants, hence their presence can keep oxidative stress at bay. Oxidative stress is the accumulation of harmful free radicals in the body. It causes damage to the cells of the body if left on their own. Antioxidants neutralize these radicals and keep their numbers in check. If you'd like to find out more about oxidative stress and antioxidants, we have done separate videos on both of these topics already. The links are in the description box below. Anyways, these antioxidative properties make polyphenols beneficial for conditions like cancer, heart disease, and diabetes. They are also thought to have anti-inflammatory properties, hence they can also help to prevent many chronic illnesses. Over the years, more than 8,000 different types of polyphenols have been identified, which can further be classified into four main groups. Flavonoids account for 60% of all polyphenols and are found in onions, apples, and dark chocolate, among others. Phenolic acids make up 30% of polyphenols and are found in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and seeds. Polyphenolic amides are found in chili peppers and oats. Other polyphenols like resveratrol and red wine, curcumin and turmeric, and lignans and flaxseed. Now let's look at the top 7 health benefits of polyphenols, which make them such a hot topic in the health and fitness industry. Number 1. May lower the risk of type 2 diabetes. One of the most amazing health benefits of polyphenols is their ability to lower blood sugar levels. Even among the polyphenols, studies have found anthocyanins to be especially beneficial for diabetes. They are so good at this because of two important characteristics of polyphenols. Firstly, polyphenols may prevent the breakdown of starch into simple sugars. Well, if the starch doesn't get converted to sugars, then of course there would be a lower likelihood of blood sugar spikes after meals. Secondly, they may help stimulate the secretion of insulin. Insulin is the hormone that's necessary for the transfer of sugar from the blood into the cells. Thus, by stimulating the production of this invaluable hormone, polyphenols in effect lower the blood sugar levels. Many studies in recent years have found a beneficial impact of polyphenols on all the risk factors associated with type 2 diabetes, like fasting blood sugar levels, glucose tolerance, and insulin sensitivity. One such study found that people who ate the highest amounts of polyphenol-rich food had a 57% lower risk of developing type 2 diabetes over the next 2 to 4 years when compared with those who ate the lowest amounts of these foods. Number 2. May provide protection against obesity. The biggest nightmare for some and a sad reality for others, obesity is a real problem for not only the US but the whole world. According to The Who, in 2016, more than 1.9 billion adults were overweight and 650 million of them had already crossed the red line of obesity. That was in 2016. Things have gotten worse since then. According to the National Center for Biotechnology Information, 20% of the world population will be obese by 2030. We can thank our fast food industry for that. To protect yourself from this epidemic, you need to make intelligent food choices, consume more whole foods, and avoid processed foods. In this struggle against obesity, fruits and vegetables are considered the most effective tools, not just because of the fiber content, but also due to the large amounts of polyphenols. In one study that explored the connection between the intake of polyphenols and BMI, researchers found a definite link between higher intake of flavonoids and a lower BMI and waist circumference, further establishing polyphenols as effective means of curbing obesity. Number 3. May lower the risk of heart disease. Increasing intake of polyphenols can do wonders for your heart. This is because polyphenols can tackle the three major risk factors of heart disease all on their own. The antioxidant properties of polyphenols can help to reduce chronic inflammation, which is a major risk factor for heart disease. Also, polyphenol supplements have been linked with lower blood pressure, lower LDL cholesterol, and higher HDL cholesterol. A review study links the intake of polyphenols, particularly lignans, to a 45% lower risk of death from heart disease. So what's so special about lignans? Researchers have found that lignans help reduce inflammation, which is a risk factor for heart disease. By the way, if you are interested in decreasing your likelihood of dying from a heart attack, lignans are found in virgin olive oil, flaxseed, and whole grains. Number 4. May Boost Memory and Focus 
If you're one of those who has to put extra effort into remembering stuff and focusing on things that's just not your ball game, then it is time to increase your intake of polyphenols. Many studies have found a link between intake of polyphenols and improved brain function. One such study found that drinking polyphenol-rich grape juice gave a memory boost to older people with mild mental impairment in just 12 weeks. Similarly, cocoa flavanols have also been found to improve blood flow to the brain and thus improve working memory and attention. Number 5. May Prevent Blood Clots Ever wondered how the blood coming out of a cut stops on its own? The answer is platelets. The platelets flow around in the bloodstream, and when a blood vessel is injured, those platelets clump together and try to plug the hole. This platelet aggregation, as they call it, is useful in preventing excessive bleeding. But what if platelets start to clump together inside the blood vessels without any signs of injury? Then you've got a serious problem on your hands. These blood clots can cause many issues like deep vein thrombosis, stroke, and pulmonary embolism. But if you have a habit of eating a lot of nuts, seeds, fruits, and vegetables, then you don't have much to worry about, as polyphenols may help reduce the platelet aggregation process and so can prevent the formation of blood clots. Number 6. May Benefit Digestion We all know how fiber and plant-based foods can be beneficial for our digestive system. What's surprising, though, is that it isn't just fiber that makes plant-based foods so gut-friendly. Polyphenols also have a role in this. Research has found that polyphenol-rich tea extracts promote the growth of beneficial gut bacteria, called the bifidobacteria, and also help fight off harmful bacteria including E. coli and salmonella, thus protecting the gut on both fronts. But that's not all. Polyphenols have also been found to improve symptoms of troublesome conditions like peptic ulcer disease, or PUD, and inflammatory bowel disease, IBD. To top it all, the latest research suggests that polyphenols may help probiotics in fermented foods and supplements thrive, thus improving their effectiveness by many folds. Number 7. May Protect Against Cancer There's a reason plant-based diets are linked with a lower risk of cancer. Polyphenols are perhaps the holy grail of anti-cancer compounds that could be consumed through food. They have antioxidant as well as anti-inflammatory properties, both of which can help in cancer prevention. To give these claims some substance, a recent review of test tube studies suggests that polyphenols may stop various cancer cells from growing. Similarly, some human studies have linked high blood markers of polyphenol intake to a lower risk of breast and prostate cancers. These results are encouraging, but there's still a lot of room for more research that could solidify the connection of polyphenol intake with a lower risk of cancer. Now you know what amazing benefits are in store for you, once you start giving polyphenols their due share of attention. But how should you go about including these compounds into your diet? Well, you don't have to scratch your head too hard to find polyphenols. They are in many of the fruits, vegetables, nuts, and seasonings that you eat. However, some foods are richer in polyphenols than others. Among them, cloves, black pepper, cocoa powder, berries like blueberries and strawberries, nuts like hazelnuts and almonds, flax seeds, olive oil, vegetables, and coffee are the richest in polyphenols. If you're not a big fan of these foods, then another way of going about it is through supplementation. However, supplementation will keep you from enjoying other nutritional benefits of foods, and they have also been found to have some side effects. One of them, and perhaps the most commonly reported one, is that they may hinder the absorption of iron in the body. Finally, to summarize, polyphenols are plant-based compounds with amazing health benefits. Among them is their ability to lower the risk of type 2 diabetes and heart disease, protect against obesity, and boost memory and focus. Some of the richest food sources of polyphenols include cloves and seasonings like black pepper, berries, nuts, and vegetables. Polyphenols can also be ingested through supplements, but it is not recommended since there are a few side effects associated with supplementation. One of them is that they may interfere with iron absorption in the body. With that, we come to the end of today's video. We hope that you benefited from this video. If you did, please hit the like button and share the video with your friends and family. Want to see more videos like this one? Please subscribe to our channel, Welcome to Wellness, and press the bell icon as well so you never miss another video. We'll see you in another healthy video. Until then, take care.